Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mariah. And if you're new here, hey girl, what's up? And if you're returning, thank you. <laughs> Don't count yourself out right away. Cramp in my ass. And now I need another shower. I was just gonna give up play mask. Mine's cracked too! This pink one actually matches. So, this is how my morning is going. Yep, that's throw up alright, but that's not even the best part. That's not the best part, y'all. Look at the throw up, and it smells so bad. The even better part is I had just got out the shower, washed my hair, smelling good and fresh. Had a cute outfit on. These were the shorts that I had got from Costco that I, I decided to wear because they fit good. They look cute. This cute little fringe top on. And now I need another shower. And I smell like straight up throw up. But I can't even take a shower right away because Chris is not here. He had just left. So I'm kind of stuck smelling like baby milk throw up. I don't know how long until Chris comes home so I'm about to send him a picture of this to show him that when he gets home please expect that I will be taking another shower because <laughs> this is not happening right now like <sighs> I can't even I really can't <laughs> just it was just like it was a lot I've never seen that happen before on top of being grossed out I'm kind of concerned at the same time he's over there playing on my bed but I'm also concerned about like why he threw up that much. It was, I mean, like it was a lot. I've never seen him do that much throw up. Usually spit up. He'll spit up on me or something. But he literally barfed out so much milk. <sighs> so look at that on the side too. It's gross. Well, I'm gonna try to strip down and get a new outfit on. But yeah, that's that. Okay. So I changed. Didn't take a shower though. Still have not taken a shower, but I did change. I tried to like wipe down as much of the throw up as possible, but hopefully I take a shower soon. We shall see. But right now what I want to do is unbox the trash cans because I need one in my in my bedroom like ASAP. We're gonna do that now. And excuse me, I'm not wearing a bra, so try to ignore it. Sorry. I do want to talk to you guys though because I just <sighs> So I've been going through like this situation with my breast milk during the whole situation with going to all the parties and the wedding and stuff like that and the reception and just super busy. I haven't I haven't been pumping and I haven't been breastfeeding. I've been giving Nehemiah the bottle mostly, primarily breastfeeding him only at nighttime when he's sleeping. It kind of backfired on me. So I'm trying to rebuild up the production of milk that I produce in my boobs. And it's been a slow, slow, slow uphill battle. I think I'm finally starting to see the light. <laughs> Because <laughs> for a minute I was getting scared. I thought I was going to like lose the milk that I was producing. And I thought I was going to stop producing. I was getting worried. But it seems like it is coming back. I just was going crazy. Like literally every couple hours. Even at midnight. I mean even at night. Like I would wake up every couple hours just to pump. Even if it only get only. And I would usually only get like an ounce or so or a little bit. But I didn't care. I was pumping, 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 pumping like crazy. Trying to get the flow of milk in my boobs to produce more like it used to. So I think it's... Um, starting to pr produce more milk which makes me happy because I was getting super scared because um, my boobs started leaking and they feel a lot they feel a little bit better they don't feel as deflated <laughs> so that's like a sign of it's doing better I think last night when I pumped I got two ounces instead of just one sometimes I when I first started pumping back after after going like maybe a week or so not doing any of that, I was getting like less than an ounce, like a couple drops, and it was making me really nervous, but it's getting there. I'm getting like two ounces recently, so hopefully I can, I'm trying to get it up to the volume where I used to be able to fill up the whole, like this whole bottle. And this is about four ounces, but if I fill it up all the way to the top, it's probably about six, so that's where I'm trying to get back to. But I feel like 
to be honest like anyone can do it like if you feel like you're starting to lose the amount of milk you produce I would just say don't give up. Keep pumping, pump like crazy. Even if you feel like you're only getting a few drops, just pump, 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 pump. And then when he's up, let him drink. And after he gets full, pump, pump, pump the rest out. And just keep pumping and your, your production should slowly come back. That's a word of advice. Don't get too scared. Don't count yourself out right away. Don't give up. Just pump like your life dep depends on it because it does. Your baby's does. <laughs> I'm finally going to open it up. Because I need a trash can upstairs real bad. By the way, today is Sunday. God's day, you know. I hope whoever went to church today, I hope you guys had a good service. I hope you prayed today. I hope you were thankful today. Today is a beautiful day. A day to be happy and joyous. So, happy Sunday. Man, this stuff smells like brand new. are pretty nice. Be small like this, but so this is what it looks like. Unpackaged. They're pretty small. Two pack at Costco. It has like that soft clothes. I love it. Alright, so that was pretty much it for right now. Probably gonna go watch this show I've been binging with Chris for a little bit and I think Nehemiah just woke up too so there's that it literally lasts like a couple minutes I can do something I get one little thing done here he is say hi Nehemiah <laughs> hi hi son <laughs> Back in business, y'all. So this is what I pumped about 30 minutes ago. I was letting it get cold, cold in the refrigerator, but it's almost four ounces, almost four ounces. And then this was a little bit that I had last night. I think it was like two ounces, but I didn't have enough to fill the bag, so I saved it. But I think I'm back in business. We produce in and I feel it. It's getting, oh shit. It's getting full again. I dropped the baggie and it was open. I'm about to lose what I just got. The rest that I have that didn't fit in the baggie, I'm just gonna put it in here to make little icicles because we haven't made any in a minute because, girl, I haven't had enough. I'm gonna see if Nehemiah wants this. <laughs> you guys! So, Hey guys, so I got dressed. It's a new outfit, new day. Today is Monday. Oh man, I have this huge cramp in my ass. It is no joke, it hurts so bad. I know that might be too much information, but it's, it's the honest truth and I can't even fake it. It hurts so bad, I'm walking funny and everything because I'm on my period, so I can't wait till it's over. But anyways, I'm outside, we're about to leave. We have to go to Starbucks, of course, because that's how I have to start my day. I need some coffee. 
or I'm a walking zombie. And then we have to go to Petco again to get some more food. And we need to go to Home Depot to grab a few things and to Target because I need some more deodorant. So we got a whole list of things to do. And then I have a few updates to talk to you guys about. But I want to show you guys my furniture. So this is the outside furniture from in the front. We finally, Chris finally got it built. And then there is the table. Isn't that cute? Then I put my little plant on top of it. And then we have this chair and then we have this one right here so you know it's a whole vibe out here it's real cute it's getting there all the bro bros all the bro bros we're getting some breakfast burritos guys your girl is starving look at these earrings y'all they're leaves aren't they cute they're like gold plated i like it <laughs> I have the same ones, but they're like, they look actually green. But I thought these ones would fit my outfit better today. I hate wearing these breast pads because then they like show. Good morning, what can I get for you? And I don't like Can I that. get a nugget, a super burrito with chicken? Can I do grilled chicken and no beef? Try it one more time. You want chips? I mean, cheese on the chips? Okay, thank you. This pineapple drink at Alda at Alda Bro Bros is so good. Nehemiah is teething, and he's very, very upset. Guys, we're looking for like a mat to go under Nehemiah's playpen to add more cushion, but there's nothing like soft enough to really do that. See, this one's a yoga mat and it feels way nicer. Look at this. It's for the thighs. Alright y'all, we are back home. We went to Target and I went a little bit crazy. Well, not that bad. I went in like the little $5 section that they have by the front entrance. And I'm gonna show y'all what I got. Cause I got a lot of good stuff. Speaking of. <laughs> and then we also went to Starbucks. But I think this guy is ready for a nap. Right, Nehemiah? Are you ready for a nap? I'm ready for a nap. No nap for mama. Is that her pajita? I know how to run from the dark and fly. Feel my wings spread, levitate into the clouds. I'm so high above the ground. Alright guys, so I just gave Nehemiah some, um, why would you throw that down there? So now I gotta clean it. Here. So like I was saying, um, I just gave him some Motrin to help with his teething because his teething causes other things to happen it'll make him sick it'll give him a fever the ear infections it won't help the ear infections it'll make it worse just a lot of things so i'm trying to combat that with motrin but or tylenol but it sucks because i hate like just giving him loads of medication he's been taking a lot of medication uh, he's been taking a lot of medication lately and it's just it's frustrating <laughs> i hate it but this is prime time guys Seven to 12 months is, and he just turned seven months. And this is the time where this teething is really gonna start pushing through. 
So it's going to be a lot of crying, sad nights, but I'm going to try to get through it with my son. We'll get, we'll get through it together. <laughs> well, I want to do like a haul with you guys of like all the stuff I got. Show. Sure. Sure, I'm going to try to go through this pretty fast because I don't know how much time he's going to give me to show you guys, but we shall see. All right, so this is a Target haul, y'all. And I want to go to Trader Joe's. And then I want to go back to Target because I want to get that little thing I saw for his bath. Put all the toys that he has. It's a little... Basket. Yeah, I took it so down. I and I just saw it too. I don't know why I didn't grab it either. And I was like, should have grabbed it. Because I have all these toys. I can't... I don't want to leave it. I want it to dry and not get moldy. Yeah. All right. So we might have a Trader Joe's haul later, y'all. But right now, let's get into it. So for Target, remember how I was telling you guys that I went to like the little $5 bin section where they keep like all the $5, $1, $3 stuff right by the entrance? So I found these. It's so ghetto though. They didn't they didn't have no no decoration or no like type name or anything on it. But I looked underneath and it says five dollars. Damn, I didn't realize how thick these were. Why do you only buy two though? I don't know. I was rushing. What, what is that for? Like wine or something? Yeah, but look look how thick this glass is. Buy a couple more wine glasses. You guys, it is thick. Dollars? Oh, it's no way. <gasps> Mine's cracked too. No. no. No, I said yours is cracked, not mine. We're gonna, wow. we're, we're gonna return it. Look at his crotch, y'all. I'm mad. $5 for real. We'll return both of them. There's that. Well, hopefully we stop by. Well, we're going to Target anyway, so yeah. We got some more wet jet refills for our Swiffer wet jet. We got the, the dry cloth wet jet refills. Because we have the mop version and then we have the Swiffer version. So we got one for the mop and one for the Swiffer. So then I got this little tower thing. It was five dollars. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. I really don't. But I just thought it was cute and it was only five bucks. I could put something cute on it. I just gotta figure it out. Maybe I'll put it in my room somewhere. It's cute. Then um, Chris picked out this cute little pillow with like all the different shades of hands and then the earth sign. It's like togetherness, you know. And he got this for Nehemiah. <laughs> he thought it was cute. And while we're on the subject of Nehemiah stuff, we also got this little plushie. I forgot what the the, ch the, the checkout lady called this. She knew exactly what it was. I just thought it was cute. It's a Pokemon person. It's called uh, Squishmallows. Squishmallows. It's a Pokemon Squishmallow. But the cute thing is, um, I gave Nehemiah options. I, I, I held up like two for him, for him to pick one. And tell me, y'all, he snatches with his hands just like this and pull the tourism out of it. Like, oh, yep, this is the one. He wants that one. So we got this one. <laughs> oh, that's so cute, Sean. You're so cute. Oh, you like... Oh, you like that one. I'm glad you like it, son. This next one is special and dear to my heart, y'all. Like, I just... When I saw this, I didn't care if I didn't get nothing else. The fact that I'm about to get this one is like the universe brought me to this one. Y'all, tell me why. And if it don't work, I'ma cry. <laughs> it is a mini little fan. Super cute and tiny. Five bucks at Target, y'all. I didn't just get one. Five dollars. I got two. I got a white one and a blue one. Y'all, y'all, if y'all know me, if y'all been watching my channel and keeping up with my issues, Y'all know why I got this. So I'm about to put this in my room. And whenever I do my makeup, I'm about to turn this little bad boy on. Put it right next to me. It's going to be point, it's gonna be tilted right up to my face. And I'm just going to get the breeze just in the wind. Then I got two packs of Dove deodorant. The reason I went to Target. Two, two packs. And I got it in like the cucumber flavor. I like this one. I like the flavor. Or the scent. Excuse me. Speaking of scents, I got some candles. Three dollars. I got three of them. Now, these ones are so cute. So, so cute. I just like that the colors. I think they had a pink one or something, but I like that these colors. I thought they would go perfect together. Cute decoration somewhere in my room. I don't know. I got some clay masks so I can do some cute facials. Two of the cooling avocado clay masks. They were like a dollar. And I just wanted to try them. I think they're, they probably last maybe twice. I can probably squeeze maybe two of these, two masks out of these. Foliating strawberry, cleansing aloe vera, hydrating pineapple. I'm excited y'all. Best believe we're gonna, I'm gonna be doing a little review for y'all. It's gonna be real, real cute. I haven't did a mask on my channel in a minute, so we need to do that. 
Then I got this inflatable beverage like holder and it's shaped as a um, cactus. Five dollars! Cute and it floats so we're gonna put it in the pool. Y'all, I went crazy in that five dollar section and y'all girl was in heaven. And then I got these um, cleansing, um, what are these? Cleansing shoe covers. So what I'm thinking is I'm gonna wear these when I'm mopping the floors. You know, when I mop, I can wear these so that instead of wearing socks, I can just wear this and it'll help clean at the same time. So I thought that was cool. So I got one of these, one pair of those. Now I got this like little cute woven basket and it has like a cute little top on it. it comes with like a little tie in the front and you just kind of like take it over it and take it off and it lifts up. Little tie in the back that keeps it on intact. And it looks like this on the inside. I don't know what I'm gonna put in it, y'all. And I don't care. I just thought it was so, so cute. <laughs> Nehemiah's getting restless. I'm running out of time. What's wrong? What's wrong? Your teeth hurting? Mommy almost done. Mommy almost done. I found the receipt so I can return those glasses. I got this little candle. It's a sn snuffer and a dipper. So you can cover this to put out the candle. And I think this kind of, I don't know what this does. I didn't really buy this for this. I bought it for this one. This is for my candles because I'm tired of blowing it out and the smoke kind of goes everywhere. So this, at least if I use this to cover it and, you know, take the fire out, then it'd be less smoke everywhere. They also had some socks, y'all. And they were a dollar. Come on, a dollar? I could not say no. That's a dollar. And they were so cute. Look at these ones. These are so cute, right? And then these cheetah ones. So cute. And then I got these ones. They have like little X's on them. I just thought these were these were perfect. These are so cute. I gotta when I go to Target, I gotta go in these five dollar sections way more often because I was missing out. Cause they interchange them pretty often throughout the seasons. So every time I go to Target, I'm gonna stop by there now. Then I got these little y'all know how I feel about like my scrunchies. I love me my scrunchies. I'm a scrunchie girl. Scrunchies for life. This pink one actually matches. Put it on right now. This is cute. And then I got a purple one. And this like blue one with like smiley faces on there. So I know that was cute. So, 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 so cute. I'm almost done, can I finish real quick? All right, well, I'm not gonna be able to finish the haul right now because Nehemiah turning up. <laughs> All right, I'll come back and finish the rest. I have a little bit more cleaning stuff to show you guys and then I got some cute bath stuff for Nehemiah. So, 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 so cute. So I'll, just, I'll be right back. I'm gonna feed him, try to put him to sleep and we'll see what happens. All right, guys, so we're back. Nehemiah had a nice, decent nap. <laughs> it's been like an hour later. He, he had a pretty good nap. He slept for about maybe 30, 40 minutes. That's pretty typical for him. Nehemiah, he really likes this plushy thing though. He picked it, so makes sense. All right, so I wanna finish up what we started. For you guys, it's probably been like a second later, but for me, it's been a minute. So I'm like, well, where are we? So. The last few bags, I got some more Swiffer duster. I got the heavy duty kind. Since we have floors and not carpet in our house, a Swiffer is like necessary, especially for like under the couch and everything. And these floors collect dust like nobody's business. Like, like they life depends on it. <laughs> scrubbing bubbles, drop-ins. Got some scrubbing bubbles. The toilet wand refills. I got, I bought the whole set. So this is the whole set. It comes with a caddy, the wand, and then um, six refillables. I got a scrub mommy. So I've been loving the yellow and the scrub daddy. After the first one I showed you guys, from the very first time I tried it, fell in love, love it. It's the best. And it lasts a good amount of time. Like a good, it lasts a really long time. So these next few things is mainly for Nehemiah's bath. I'm noticing he's getting older and more curious. He wants to play in the bath. He wants toys. He wants to do stuff while we're bathing him. So this one is a safety bath ducky. Oh, this is great. I didn't even know it did this. I thought it was just a regular ducky toy. But this actually, if you put it in the water, it'll let you know if the water's too hot for your baby. It has this little thing on it right here. It'll indicate at the very bottom of this thing. It'll light up and it's, it'll say in all caps, hot. 
if the water is too hot and if it's not too hot it'll just stay the exact same that's really cool i'm really excited this is a little well and it goes over the um the, the the bath faucet i don't have to worry about him bumping himself right now because he's still inside of the grow with me tub so he's not really gonna get far i got some bath toys but since he still likes to bite on everything this is perfect he can gnaw on it and have fun and it's cute man i'm really amazed by this this is great <laughs> I've always been the mom that feels like the water's too hot. <laughs> the last thing we got from Target is this little bubble maker. It's so cute. I saw one of um, Chris's friends, um, their daughter had one that they bought for her. And I thought that was the cutest thing ever. And I was like, I gotta get my son one. I can't, what? He needs a bubble machine. Yes, he's gonna make bubbles. Isn't that so cute? That's cute, right? And it wasn't too bad either. That's pretty much everything. I did a little damage today. Nothing too crazy. Also, another update on my milk. This was the milk I had pumped last night. I had put it in the refrigerator. I think I got like another three ounces again. Feeling better. I'm feeling a lot better. I just gotta keep it up, stay consistent, and I should be fully recovered. <laughs> He loves that thing. <laughs> so cute. the glasses on today girl but we are back home i have a whole bunch of stuff so we were supposed to go to target for two things i got a whole bunch of stuff this is all the trader joe's stuff that i have right here i found a cute little olive bear, aloe vera plant i want to put it outside and then this is another outside plant that i want to put outside i thought it was so cute hopefully i can keep it alive and then here's some of the house flowers that I found that I'm gonna make a bouquet out of later on, probably tomorrow. I'm really tired. Bye. 